Hello and welcome to Ubuntu. Sorry if my battery has just come up low. I need to plug that in. I will do it as soon as I've finished this recording. Right, this is Ubuntu. What is it you say? Well, it is a Linux distro, which is an alternative to Windows, if you were wondering, okay? But you don't need to worry about that. Just remove Windows, install Ubuntu, and you'll be fine. Right, so at the top right-hand corner, you get all the very similar things you get um, on a Mac, in fact, which I hate saying similar, but not the same. Or on Windows. You get your like Wi-Fi networks, you get your battery, sound, date and clock, all that kind of stuff is up there. If you click here, you can log out, you get your system settings, all of that stuff. Right, then you have the wallpaper, which is brilliant. I've actually taken this from the 1404 um, LTS release, which isn't out on stable yet, so don't worry about that. I will be reviewing that when it's up. But I just thought it looked too good to leave on there. If you right click the desktop, you can change desktop background, which is great. I mean, you know, just select from whatever. There's some great wallpaper. I mean, look at that. It looks amazing. Um, it's really, 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 uh, it's a really pretty distribution. Um, if you tab back, you can select you can view all the settings which is you know it's it's just pretty cool uh, it's just very similar to what any other operating system that you've ever used you will not have trouble with ubuntu it's not for geeks like people seem to assume when thinking of linux okay now um you get a this is the launcher uh, which is transparent and looks pretty cool. Oh, one thing, talking about geeks, right? If you press Control Alt T, it brings up the terminal, which you probably will never have to use. But if you do, it's good to learn a few little uh, command tips and techniques to help you guide yourself through that and make sure that you don't have any problems, you know, doing that. But I'm going to put up videos to show you how to do that in the future so stay tuned for those um now on ubuntu on the like standard install you get a office suite which is great you get calculator calendar um there's all sorts of things you get that uh you know you don't get for free on windows which is good you get a software center which I know is on yeah, also on OS X and now on Windows 8 but it's great I mean anything you know you look for something if you need something have a look you should find it on here um, it even has Steam which makes this probably the best platform for gaming on Linux okay Ubuntu rules in that genre and apparently I haven't tested it myself but the benchmarks on a few games actually are better on Ubuntu than they are on Windows 8 which I'm sure is a kick in the ball to a lot of people <laughs> but you know that's just the way it goes when you have a free open source um, world with you know well I'll save that discussion for another time. Now, what else is there? I don't believe there's anything else. My battery has just come up red. I guess it is time for me to leave. Thank you for watching. Um, there'll be more videos. Great. And this is Ubuntu.